But for someone out there that is like just starting to read the Bible, wants to dive into it, you think you guys could go through just a good start to understand Jesus and who he was. When you read the Gospel of John, he begins with, in the beginning was the Word, and the Word was with God, and the Word was God. And John uses this Greek word logos, which is word, to refer to Jesus. In other words, God has communicated. God has spoken. That harkens back to Genesis 1-1, in the beginning, God said, let there be light, let there be the sun, let the water be separated from the earth. So the word of God is presented right there in John chapter 1 as Jesus, who is God's clearest revelation of himself. And then in John chapter 2, you have Jesus' first miracle, where he turns water into Coca-Cola. <laughs> no, he turns water into wine, yep. not supporting drunkenness, but supporting a poor family that had run out of wine at the wedding feast of their child. And with great compassion, he turns water into wine. And also in John chapter 2, he clears the temple. And if anybody says that I can't accept Jesus because of religious hypocrisy, they haven't read John chapter 2. What Jesus did with the religious hypocrites was he physically kicked them out of the temple because they were preying upon people's desire to know God to make a haul of cash. And Jesus says, no, he ain't going to do that here. You don't use people's desire to know God to rip them off financially. And then in John chapter 3, Jesus has that incredible conversation with Nicodemus.